Hi, my name is Sylvain. I'm one of the founding brothers of Stump Chunks. My goal here today is to provide you with information about our company, who we are, where we came from, our products, how to use Stump Chunks, and more importantly, how to effectively sell Stump Chunks in your store based on the information we've gathered for the past five years. The question often asked us is, who is Stump Chunks? Well, our company was founded on a cold New Hampshire winter night when my three brothers and I discovered the power of the stump and how easy it was to just use a handful of this stump chunks to light a fire. Our family's been in the recycling business, the wood business for over 30 years, trying to find better ways to utilize mother nature's resource. Stump chunks is one of those ways. It's really in the past Stumps were just buried in a hole, covered up, left to decompose, no longer. Now you, your family, can enjoy the power of the stump at home. We're a family business, and it was a real simple idea. Let's bag this. Let's let every other family enjoy the power of the stump. Let them light a fire faster, quicker. Help them get to step three. And step three is a very important step of lighting a fire. It's so important. We put it on the back of the bag. I'll read it to you. Step three just simply says, open beverage, put up feet, relax, enjoy. So give Stump Chunks a try. It just works. So let me tell you a little bit about what Stump Chunks is. Stump Chunks is an all-natural kindling and fire starter. It's made from the stumps of the trees, everything under the ground. So when you're lighting a fire, what you want to do is get high heat for an extended period of time. That'll light anything. The wetter the product or the more moisture, the more heat for the longer period of time you need. So our product, because it's made from the roots of the trees, holds a higher temperature. It's also hard and gnarly, so it'll burn longer. So all you need to start a fire, but I always put a couple pieces of wood down. I'll take a softball size handful like this. I'll put it on top put my other wood on top and light it. You'll be able to see all the little hairs and that's what you want to light. You light those little hairs. It gets the fire lit quick. And then just relax and enjoy. You know, how much product should I use? Really depends on how wet your wood is and how big of a rush you're in. Yeah, you know, I'm one of the owners of the company. I use a lot. I want a fire, I want it quick. But really a softball size handful, a baseball size handful is all you need. We were very excited to uh, get the uh, 2016 Retailer's Choice Award this year. Um, that means that you, the retailers, thought we had a great product. And now we are finding out how fantastic and fun it is to sell stump chunks. We're environment environmentally friendly. We don't cut down any trees for this. The stumps have been brought to us for the past 35 years we've been in this business. All right, where can you use stump chunks? Let me think of the places. You got a fireplace? works great. Wood stove, fantastic. Let me tell a little story about a wood stove. I had a wood stove. I'd get up in the morning, I'd light my stove, put a little fire in, I'd light it, I'd get my paper and my kindling, and I'd go take a shower. I'd come back and cross my fingers that the fire was lit. And if it wasn't, I'd have to roll up my sleeves, get dirty, relight the fire. With stump chunks, you'll never have that problem. A piece of wood, Handful of the wood light it, go take a shower, come back. You don't even have to worry about your fire. Fire pits. Fire pits are great. You could be in a room of a thousand people and you could say, hey, anybody here know how to light a fire? Everyone would raise their hand. Which one of you guys want to light a fire in front of me, in front of us today? And most of the hands would go down. You know, you have friends coming over, you don't light your fire while they're there. Ooh, how much fun is that while your buddies, hey, let me show you how to light that fire. No, no, no. You want to light your fire. You light your fire before they get there. Now with stump chunks, you can have your 10-year-old kid show up uh, to your friends on how to light a fire. This picture this, his wife will be going, hey, you need to learn from his kid. So fire pits, charcoal grills. Char if there's a knock on charcoal, it isn't that it doesn't make your food taste great. There's two knocks that I get all the time. One is, hey, it's a mess. So I tell you what, I'm sure you have some gloves in your store. Sell a guy a pair of gloves. Number two, takes too long. Basically, two ways to do charcoal that uh, most people use. So, one way is you can lay down your charcoal in your grill, take stump chunks, sprinkle it on top like cheese on a pizza. 
If you're in a big rush, use a little extra cheese. Light it in a couple spots, eight, 10 minutes you're cooking. The other way is a chimney starter. I'm sure you have that in your store. With a chimney starter, you just take a baseball size handful. Matter of fact, what I tell customers to do is I'll tell them to take a little piece of tin foil, uh, yay big, six inches square, put it down, take a small handful of stump chunks, about a baseball size handful, that way it doesn't go through the grill, it's on the tin foil, you light it, you take your full chimney, place it on top. When your chimney's three quarters full, you're ready to dump and cook. That normally takes about four and a half to five and a half minutes you're ready and you're cooking. Everyone else is trying to get their grill warm. You're already going. Uh, pizza ovens are very popular. Uh, we have a lot of companies uh, that have pizza ovens that use our product. Light the oven. I have one at home. I light my pizza oven with it. You can either just lay your wood down, put stump chunks, put your wood across, light it. I personally will light a bed of charcoal first. Sprinkle stump chunks in the charcoal, light it. When my charcoal is good and hot, I'll put wood on it, and I'll retake stump chunks and place it on top to help the wood light quicker. It just gets my pizza oven lit quicker. And speaking of reigniting fires, and uh, anytime you add wood to a fire, add a little stump chunks. It'll help the wood light fire. You come back from camping, and the fire's half dead. What do you do? That's the hardest fire to light without making a mess. Take a couple handfuls of stump chunks, put them on the coals, put your wood on it right away. You relit your fire, you don't have a boatload of smoke, and you're enjoying step three right away. Matter of fact, the thought for campfires, you can find this video online. It's called Lighting Wet Wood. It's on our website, it's on YouTube. We marinated some wood underwater for 30 hours. We used a whole bag of stump chunks, dumped it in the fire pit, put eight logs around it, lit it. I put my phone on as a timer. In three and a half minutes, the flames are about three and a half feet high and the wood was crackling. I don't know about you, I don't know what else will light wet wood that easy. And I will tell you a little story about a fireplace. Um, I used to have a fireplace at my home. Every time I lit it, the smoke would fill the house. Eventually, my wife said, you're not lighting fires in the fireplace anymore. I don't like the smoke. Well, now I can light my fire in the fireplace. You can light your fire in your fireplace without all that smoke. Why does that smoke come in? The smoke's not hot enough to get the smoke up the chimney. Matter of fact, a little trick my uncle taught me was to light a little piece of paper and start getting the heat up the chimney and it'll bring the smoke up. You don't even have to do that anymore. Stump chunks will burn so hot, so quick, the smoke will immediately go up your flute and won't go in your house. Stay with me. We'll teach you some more about stump chunks. Thank you. Hi, I'm here to introduce you to our family of bags. This is our 0.3 cubic foot bag. This is one of our first bags. It's our best selling bag. This is the bag the customers are gonna buy and is gonna fly through your store. One of the reasons it's gonna fly through your store is this little bag. This little bag is for customers to try our product. For customers to bring, they're going camping, they only need a little bit. They're going on a little picnic at the beach. But this bag right here, you give out some of these bags, you're going to sell some of these bags. Recently introduced was our plastic bag. This is a waterproof plastic bag with a tear-off top and Ziploc, so it'll stay waterproof. The customer can take what he wants, reload it, zip it up. This is a great bag to use when you're camping, fishing, ice fishing, snowmobiling, four-wheeling. Matter of fact, I might recommend that you tell your customers they ought to have one of these bags in their car. You never know when you're in a snowstorm and you're stuck and you need to light a fire. My favorite bag is our 1.5 cubic foot bag. There's five of these in that bag right there. It makes it so much more convenient for your customers. They can put this by the fireplace. They can put this by the wood stove. I keep one with my charcoal so I can light my charcoal. What's great about this bag, when you have a little bag like this, you use a little bit. When you have a bigger bag, you use a lot. You use more, they come back in your store and buy more. This is our family of bags. In this segment, we're going to talk a little bit more about how you can be successful selling stump chunks in your stores. And I, I'm no expert in marketing. I'm no expert in sales.
Everything I know has come from customers. It's come from people who have been selling stunt chunks. We've been selling here in New England for the past five years. I remember in the beginning, we had some customers that were doing just okay. And some that were doing great. Here's what I learned. Customers would bring the product in. And it's a fire starter. Me and my brothers thought we were in the fire starter business. And they'd throw the product on the shelf at the fire starter. And it'd move okay, but it wasn't moving great. Go see another customer, and he'd blown it out the door. So I had to go see what he was doing. Well, he's giving the product away, he tells me. Ah. Well, what he did is he would take apart this bag, and he'd make little lunch bags. And Joe would come in, and he knew Joe, because Joe had a fireplace, or Jim, he had sold Jim a grill, a charcoal grill, and he'd go, hey, and he'd explain the product to him. This is stump chunks. This is how it works. You've got to go home and try it. You guys go home and try it. I come back and buy this bag. Matter of fact, I stole that idea from the customer, and we made our own sandwich bag. That's the power of this small bag, is it gets them back to buy this bag. And then eventually, it gets them to buy our large bag. So un understanding that, Getting people to try the product. Because I will tell you, if a guy is using a fire starter today, he is not going to change unless you give him a reason to change. Give him a sample. That will give him a reason to change. Here's something else we found out. We start pulling our consumer base. And over 70% of our customers never used a fire starter before. They weren't even going down the fire starter aisle. They were the paper and kindling crowd. They like to be all natural. They don't want to use any chemicals. They don't want any help. That's our, the majority of our customer. Well, the only way to get that customer is to take our display here and put it somewhere where they're going to see it. Because they're going to see this name, Stump Chunks, and they're going to go, what's that? They might think it's chips, food of some sort. I don't know, smoking chips, charcoal, who knows what that. They won't know by seeing the name. Perfect opportunity for you to say, hey, Jim, you ought to try this product. I tried it at home. It's fantastic. I light my fireplace with it every day. And you explain to them how to use it. The more you can get them excited about going home to try it, the more they're bound to try it within a week. It's funny, there's, there's people I've given bags to in the early days that just now are coming back to me and saying, hey, I tried it the other day. Well, I gave it to you two years ago. I didn't give it to them the right way. I didn't get them excited. I just gave them a bag and said, hey, go try this next time you light a fire. Explain it to them. And let me tell you, your returns will be better. Matter of fact, we've been tracking the returns. For every 20 of this small bag that you give away, you'll get between 10 and 15 customers that come back and buy the medium bag. That ratio is going to depend on how qualified the, the consumer is that you're uh, giving the bag to. But it does work. And that's the power of sampling that bag. Um, put the product in different locations. You know, again, the display should go whether you have an end cap whether you do uh, our in-store display like this, it's fantastic. Put it where they can see it, at least for the first couple months. Also, take some bags. If you're selling charcoal or any type of grilling accessories, put some product there. If you're selling firewood, put some product with the firewood. I might not recommend that you keep the bags outside with the firework. The sun will affect the color we, you know, on the inks we use, so it, it might fade a bit. The product will work just as good. Um, now let me tell you a little bit about other things that we can do to help you. Because we're excited that you're on board. We want you to be successful for, with our product. We want your customers to love coming back in the stores just to buy a bag of stump chunks. Oh, by the way, I need a hammer. That's the key to this business. Our resources that we have for you. Videos like this and other videos for the consumers that you can play on TVs or that you can play for your employees so they can understand what stump chunks is. So when Joe asks them, what stump chunks? The answer isn't, I don't know. The boss brought it in. Let them use stump chunks. We're going to provide you with some samples. Get your employees, whoever lights charcoal, whoever lights a fire, get them to go home and use it. Then they can tell their own story. Oh, yeah, I used this the other day in a fire pit. It was fantastic. And oh, Jim works for us. He used it with his charcoal. He's telling me how great it lit his charcoal, how fast it was. Web store locator. Do me a huge favor. Once you get the product in, take a couple bags, take your staff, stand in front of your building. As you can see here, what we do up here in the picture, we're going to
put that on our web store locator. So when somebody's looking for stump chunks, they click on it, they see nice smiling faces, they see your store, it's warm, it's friendly. It's so much better than just seeing a phone number. Brochures, we have these brochures. If you have something specific you're looking for, let us know. We have an in-house art, art department. We can help you out. Banners, um, whether you need an outdoor banner, an indoor banner, you let me know. We'll design the banner, we'll get it made for you. Videos, again, anything you might need, just give us a call. We're here to help. Thank you.